Hey everybody, it's been a while since um, I've been on and I apologize for that. But as you know, if you watched my last video, we've had a lot going on here. And so I'm going to update you on that and on how I've been doing. And also I'm going to show you some gifts that y'all have sent over the holidays. And I did mean to do this video uh, sooner, but we still don't have, um, our bathrooms in place in, um, where, um, we had the sewage to go between the walls. That has been cleaned up, but, um, they haven't, <clears throat> we have our commode on our front porch, if that tells you anything. <laughs> that's where Roto Rooter put it, and that's where it remains until the um, people uh, reconstruction or something they call themselves. People come in and put stuff back, and um, it was two bathrooms were the worst part, and one has had everything taken out of it. In the other bathroom, uh, they put a commode back in it and <clears throat> they uh, had the shower fixed so we could use it because uh, to live here, you know, we have to have those things. So anyway, we're waiting on that and, <clears throat> you know, they just moved things in the house here and there. So it's... Um, it's real challenging to live here at times, but we're making it, we're doing good. And so uh, that's that. So <clears throat> um, I can't think of anything else along those lines to tell you about. Um, I can see better, I think, without those on. Um, I do think a lot of my health has been because of the black mold in the bathroom. Um, I can see better since that has been gotten rid of. And I was having to walk with help. And now I can pretty much walk without help. And um, my mind uh, was foggy. And now <clears throat> it's pretty clear. I still have a lot of problems with my breathing, but I do have COPD and asthma, so I think that maybe made it a little worse. My voice, as you can tell, is a little rough, and I apologize for that. Um, so I do feel like I'm getting better. The medication the doctor gave me for my depression is working real well, and I'm doing good with that. And um, so I think everything is on a positive note. And the prayers that y'all have given, the words of encouragement, have meant a whole lot to me and my family. And I thank you for that. Um, so that is that. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and show you the the um, gifts that y'all sent. But I do want to tell you about this behind me. This is um, quite a few uh, wooden crates. And I got those to make a homemade um, DIY coffee table in a side table but when i got them i only gave like two dollars a piece on marketplace and they have just way too many splinters in them or the wood that has the splinters and i'm afraid that um <clears throat> that, that could become a problem so what i'm gonna do is randy is going to take screws and screw them together three high and three across, so there'll be nine all together. And then if you see these, I got them at um, Big Lots. 
and they were, I believe $15, but they were marked 75% off. So I got them at a real good deal. And <clears throat> I'm gonna set those. I don't think I have nine of them, but I'm gonna set those in the crates and it's gonna go in my uh, craft room to help organize my crafts. So uh, whenever Randy feels like doing it, um, you know, we'll, we'll, when you see it gone, you'll know he felt like doing it. And right now my craft room is real full of bathroom things and other things from around the house that don't belong in there. So it'll be a while. The house is just a mess worse than usual. So what I want to do is show you things that y'all sent me over the holidays and all. And um, I always like to see what other people get. And I thought that maybe y'all, I do this every now and then. I think maybe y'all would like to see what I get. <coughs> and <coughs> Excuse me. First of all, I want to thank all of you that sent me cards or sent us cards. Um, they they were funny and beautiful and heartwarming and uh, just a mixture of everything. And it was so fun to get uh, to go to the mailbox every day and have cards. And um, there were like handmade ornaments and things like that. I know there was some red trucks which I love and I've mentioned on here. Um, ornaments and a card and um, <clears throat> what looked like uh, snowflakes and a bookmark and different little things like that that I truly do love and I thank you all who uh, took those in for doing that and there was some monetary gifts which I want you to know truly blessed us and thank you so much. Um, we've never had anything happen just right one after the other to us like did and I didn't handle it very well, I don't think on here. But um, anyway, thank you for those gifts. They mean the world and uh, uh, you're just very kind and generous and we got a food line gift card thank you so much and um, a Target gift card and thank you so much and um, so that's what was in our Christmas cards and now I'm gonna get to the gifts and if there was a name from the person that sent it, I'll say their first name. A lot of times there's not a name that I'll have to put my glasses back on. And this is from Lynn. And that's a really pretty bag it came in. And I don't know if you have ever seen these figurines before, but they are really beautiful they're the willow um figurines and they're they kind of remind me of precious moments in a way not by what they look like but just that they mark a um something that's going on in your life and so this is the little learning one and I just think she's beautiful. I think they're made out of resin maybe, but uh, let me tell you what, Love of Learning is her name. So Lynn, thank you so much. She is just beautiful. And then, I have been very excited about this and I didn't think there was a, a name 
but someone sent this cake. Merry Christmas Tort is what it's called. And it looks so good. And after I finish this video, we're gonna try that. So whoever sent that, thank you so much. It looks so good. And then this came from, let me, I remember her name, I think. But I was looking to make sure it wasn't on a piece of paper here. And I don't believe it is. <clears throat> but this is, I hope it's right, Mary Ann. You know, I love the red truck. And isn't that beautiful? And you turn it on, which it doesn't have batteries, I don't believe. But anyway, you can see where the ice skaters spin around and Santa's driving. And <clears throat> I think the lights may come on, but I just love this. So thank you so much for that. It is beautiful. And then, there's a couple really pretty homemade um, Um, ornaments that I want to show you. Um, Sherry made these. I believe she made them. And um, anyway, here is Snowflake, isn't that beautiful? And this one I believe is for Kaylin. Very talented. And then for Randy, uh, being in the military. Isn't that beautiful? He'll probably want to put this on his um, dresser because he is very patriotic and um, took the time that he served very seriously. So that's probably what he'll want to do. And then we got a tin of really delicious cookies. And every night the cookie thief would come in and help themselves. And there is one cookie left. And there was chocolate chip and macadamia nut. And there is one macadamia nut left. And these, Russ sent these. And so Russ, thank you so much. And he wanted to help with, um, somehow with the people who scanned us on the washer and dryer. But by the time uh, I had gotten his email, they had closed up their um, website, or they had at the time I looked. And also they were moving on to new things so there was no way that Russ could help but I do appreciate him having the thoughts to want to do that. That was very sweet. And then I got this um, 
Tupperware cut and serve. And I think I know why I got this. It's when I made that filled pumpkin cheesecake and I used the knife to try to serve it. I got this not long after and I thought that must be why because that was so terrible cutting it with um, that knife and it just fell apart. So there's not a name, but thank you very much for sending that. I definitely can use it. And then uh, I got this box full of goodies. It's the last thing, but um, I am really tickled about this box. It comes with uh, 10 different favorite chocolate truffles, which look so good. And we will probably open this up too when I finish the video. But it came with that. And this Lacura, I don't know if I'm saying that right, but hand cream. And with weather like this, it's really getting colder and colder every day. You need hand cream. And the checkered throw, which this is so popular, this black and white check, I love this. And I'm always cold, so um, I will enjoy putting this up next to me. And I love to sleep with <clears throat> a soft blanket. I call it a softy, just laying across my face and that will work really good. And as soon as I get off here, I'm gonna put on a pair of these good warm uh, booty booties. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what they're called, but they are so thick and warm. And I'm going to love having those on my feet. And um, this is from Kathy. She sent the card and this is from her. I'm uh, just checking to make sure. Yes. So, and wait a minute, here's one more thing I forgot. I had seen this uh, lit like chapstick. So, I will really love that. Look here also. So, if you sent something and you don't see it here, either it hasn't gotten here yet, which I'm still getting Christmas cards, or it got put somewhere, and I have tried to keep everything together, but it's been put somewhere in this crazy mess, and um, when I come across it, I'll show it in the next video. So, thank you all for everything you've done from your prayers and your warm wishes, your encouragement, all the sweet and wonderful things you've had to say. Uh, you don't know how much that touches a person. And it has really blessed our family and made this time be so much better. And I hope that you have a really blessed 2021. I hope that um, 2020 is as far away in the rear view mirror as you can see and that each of you only have good things coming your way. So take care, be blessed, and I hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.